No switch ones. Pull up my day ones. Yeah, with them fly ones. Baby, wanna see me throw huh? Came up from the garden. Yeah, came up from the garden. Oh, yeah. Came up from the garden. Yeah, came up from the garden. Yeah. No switch ones. Pull up my day ones. Yeah, with them fly ones. Baby, wanna see me throw huh? Came up from the garden. Came up from the garden. Oh, yeah. Hey, mm. how are you? I know. Uh, you having a Christmas soup again for dinner? As usual. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Auntie Christine, allow me get addicted to my Christmas soup in peace. <laughs> I'll see you again, my dear. Yeah, mother. <laughs> yeah. In the roads, January yeah. to December, we ain't never closed. But it's funny how we shut it down at every show. Still with the same ones that I came with. When the lames talk, I don't know no English. Que pasa, señorita? It's really nice to meet ya. Let's cut the chat, cause you know what the aim is. Cause you're looking like you wanna do something dangerous. Tonight I mix the ray with the flavors. Pulled up in a new shape with my old mates. Gunning for the win, I could win it more. Shot in one place, that you freak it so. Came up from my gut, I'll make you touch it so. Looking all deaf, I make you feel in your glow. You see, Ogbeni, I'm telling you, this property, I didn't acquire it for free, neither with blood money. I work hard for this place. I know. I'm paying mortgage on it, you know. Eh? You are doing shopping, you didn't pay any bills, eh? I will throw your things out. So at the end of the day, you just become homeless. And you can share a favor. There are many people to fellow BK. Okay? Uh -uh. What look, I'm talking to you. You are pressing phone. Are you deaf? Or 40? Please check your bank account. Check your bank account. Check the money is inside already. Okay. Uh, okay, I forgive you. We should be on Malua B. You behave very well this time around. And you know that this payment is only just one day late. You know that, right? You know, in this country, we have to work hard, fight hard for everything, eh? But it still doesn't mean we should be fighting each other. Huh? I'm just joking with you, just playing with you. Eh? I want you to become a good man like me, a successful man like myself. Eh? Mm. That's why I'm trying to dare you up. Eh? You too, eh? try and be a good boy. Okay. Eh, next time, don't be late. Oh, eh? <laughs> Fine boy with Mozu. Total <laughs> Hello, Daddy. Daddy, please, can you um, um, change your camera to the other direction? Because all I'm seeing is a pallor. Can you see why I said you should buy this phone for me and not your father? He's getting old. That he does not even know how to use Is this modern technology? It's like you do not realize that you are getting old too. The hair dye that you put on your head has managed to deceive you. Oh, oh, oh. Mommy, daddy, please, can you guys just stop, okay? I've just received my letter from the home office. Jesus! Time. Mommy, please, calm down. I've not opened it yet. Le wait, wait. Let me add your sister. No, mommy, mommy. Hello, Dari. You know, you still haven't paid or given me the money for my tuition yet. It's like you wanted to kick me out of university. Please, girl! Shut up! Every time you're always asking for money. Your brother just received letter from the home office. 
Finally, God has honored us. Mommy, mommy. I've not opened the letter yet, okay? Thank God. Congratulations. The UK government has eaten so much of your money, my son. You have spent so many years there. It is your home. It isn't fair. For them to keep making you spend on visas. Woman, can you please shut up? At least so that he can open the letter. Oh, he hasn't even opened it yet. Thanks, Dad. You know, ever since you entered this London, now is Dad. No more Daddy. Maybe I should go and upgrade my own accent. Well, um, he's saying that they... They rejected the application. Jesus! I could feel it in my spirit. I could feel oh, it. Oh, sorry to hear wrong. that, bro. The Holy Spirit told me something was wrong once you called. Oh, shut up! Janet, can you stop being so dramatic? Ah, for a second. Ah, ah. Hey, you know what? I'll, I'll give you guys a call back. Jesus. I'm not see for you. Ah, God, why? Why? This poor boy. He keeps applying, reapplying. A chest. Mm. Oh. Janet, mm. if you start crying and rolling on the floor, how do you expect this poor boy to react? Dapo, I told you we needed to talk. Dapo, I'm talking to you. Why are you ignoring me? Why has the diary come over? Can you come back another time? It's like you have two different personalities. You're so nice to your friend, but you're so, so terrible to me. Look, do not tell me what and what not to do in my own house. Your house? I pay half the rent here. What are you talking about? So do you have to embarrass me in front of my friend? You crazy psycho. He can't hear us, you idiot. Tell him to come back another time. This is not a good time. If you remember to take your bloody pills, every time will be a good time. You weren't saying that when Aisha was pregnant for you, but with me, it's a different story. You inconsiderate bastard. Is it because you got your British passport? No, no. It's because Aisha never threatened to poison or stab me. What else don't you understand? Go out there and get me a drink or something. If I get him that drink, I promise you, I will spit in his drink. Hey, bro! Dapo! 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 Are you sure this is a good time? Ah, why not? Of course. I mean, I, I probably should have given you a call before stopping by. No, no, no. My girl and I are happy that you stopped by. What's up? Dapo, are you sure? Ah, guy, you know I don't like repeating myself. Chill. What's up? Okay. I have bad news. Right. Okay. So the Home Office have refused my um, application. And um, I've been trying to contact, you know, that your uncle. I've called him several times, sent him text messages, he's not responding at all. Don't know what's happening. Oh, why? For, for what reason? You, you did everything legitimately, didn't you? Well, exactly. And uh, even when we were advising you to just marry one bitch again and sort out your documentation sharp sharp, you, you did do it, so... Dapo, Dapo, you know I don't fancy this whole idea of marrying British girl. Like, I don't fancy the idea of being with somebody I don't <laughs> even know for life. Tie it down to somebody. Who told you marriage was for life? Huh? Hey, oh. babe! I, I, I was just about to ask you to come and greet the diary. Why don't you bring him a drink? Oh, oh, oh no, that, that I'm fine. I don't, don't bother about drink. Don't worry, it's okay. No, no, I, I insist. <laughs> that I said it's okay. <laughs> You can't, you can't just come into my house and drink nothing. Babe, bring him a drink, that please. Body, that body, I I'm, insist. I, I'm doing dry fasting. And obviously, the doctor said I, I... You know, I told you I was meeting doctor from last week. He said I should um, abstain from water for 29 days. So I, I decided to say no more water for me. 
but liquid in general, no more liquid. I should drink spit water. And your papa go drink idiot. Well, he did this application with my uncle. And he's a big experienced lawyer. Uh, he was a big judge in Nigeria before he came here, you know. Order in court. Order in the court. Order in court. Uh, madam. How can you accuse a man that has paid your bride price of rape? Technically, he is your husband, as he has paid the price on your hair. Hmm? You should be giving it to him any time he wants it. Order a court. Do you think it is easy to pay bride price? Huh? This case is dismissed. Go home and make this man happy. Exactly. He gave me the impression that he would be able to deal with my application. And I'm, 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 I'm quite surprised why they refused me. And he did it for free. Mm, well, I wouldn't really consider £1,000 plus my application fee of £2,800 as free. And remember, he also gave me the, the, the impression that, you know, I should not apply online because it wasn't even a clever idea. And no. My uncle is an incredibly good man. He caught you his video, actually. Actually. Well, okay. But the thing is, I've been trying to contact him and he's not, you know, kicking my cause or doing it. Can you help me call him? Call cool. him. I want to hear from him. Cool. What did they say was wrong with the application? Well, um, they, they were they were saying something like I was I was I was not um um I, I was I was not qualified to get my indefinite leave to, to remain and that point, you know i've lived in this country for over 10 years yeah i've started a business in this country yeah i've invested a lot of money in this economy sure so why would they say that i'm not uh, uh, um, due to get my indefinite leave to remain like what what's up what's happening guy yeah, calm down i should calm down ah. what does he want me to say okay i'm sorry that point, please call your uncle i want to hear from your uncle Okay, say no more. I'm calling him now. Yeah, now. Like, now, now. Okay. Put, 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 put it on the outside speaker. Ah, that boy. My nephew. Bauni. Hello, Uncle. Hey, bro, hello. Uncle, I'm fine. I'm doing good. Um, Uncle. What about my friend's application? Um, I heard it got rejected and he's been trying to call you. Ah, is he the first person to get rejected? It is not a bad thing. You know he will apply again. And the second time it will go through. Ah, it is how I do for all of them. Or they will only pay me once and go away. Just like that. Whoa. God will punish you. So you, you... You purposely ruined my application. Benny, Kilode, who is that? Sir, you are you are you are you are a very wicked man. So you why? So is this what you? So is it is it the kind of uncle you have? Yeah, calm down. It's not like that. That man is a crook, and the God I serve will punish him and his family. What kind of rubbish is this? What Babe, kind of no no? Your drink. And, and and you whatever it was was that is it lucky shall be shawama? Please come and carry this your drink that's full of spit. Whatever your name is, I don't care. Yeah? Psychopaths like you, it's meant to be legal for you to reproduce. Rubbish. Wait. Get up! Mm. Bro, I was not sure you would want to see my face again after what happened, bro. Hmm. Did you know what your fake uncle lawyer was doing? Uh, 
How do I do I swear. No, I'm so sorry about what happened. <laughs> well, it has gotten worse. God damn it. I've put in the same application twice. And guess what's happened? They've refused me, despite waiting for one year. Wait. One year. And and you know and you know the and you know the worst part. Now they're having to, to send me text messages called that I need to leave the country immediately. You mean you've not gotten your papers after a year? Why are they doing that? Because they can't, Dapo. Because they can't. They know that they have the you know, you know they are able to do this to anybody just the way they want it. And you know the most annoying part is the fact that for every single application we have to pay the application fee. And guess what? It's non-refundable. Well, I don't know what to say. Though. I know so many Nigerians whose life have been ruined by immigration issues. Some separated from their spouses, even children. The thing is, the whole system is evil. They want our international school fees. They want our best talents. They want our footballers. They want us to do big, expensive shopping sprees and buy big, expensive houses, but they don't want us. They don't. Did, did you even see the racist comments? Um, Sancho, Saka, and Rashford. Rashford. Did you see what they call the Euro 2020 finals? Yeah. This racist thing, they can buy themselves some slaves. Gladiators. When we win for them, we are for them. Mm -hmm. They embrace us. But the moment they don't get what they want from us, what happens? We become the bloody immigrants. Huh? You know, what, what's even... What makes me laugh the most? Is when they complain about us killing and leeching off their NHS resources. I mean, we are the NHS. We are the ones that don't take leaves. We are the ones that don't take time off during pandemics. We are the ones who put our lives at risk in front lines, and it is not enough. Nothing is. Nothing is enough for that. Sad. It is. You know, and the funny thing is, even in our own countries. Hmm, they still treat us unfairly. Now, just have you ever questioned why a, an European will come into Nigeria, even without proper documentation? And what do we call them? Expatriates. <laughs> and you receive better salaries than his um, uh, contemporaries. Whereas, if you reverse it the other way around, you are not the expatriates, you are the immigrants. Mm. And you don't get a uh, special treatment. You don't get a car, you don't get a cook, you don't get a maid, you don't get a house, you don't get any of those things. I mean, I, I mean, take a look at you. You've been here for how many years? Done everything right. Invested in the economy. And then they just want to toss you out. What are you going to do? Come back home, of course. Wouldn't you rather be here, in your home country, where people treat you like a king, than in a country where you are regarded as a second class? No, let him stay there and fight it out. He has stayed there for over 10 years. England has become home for him. Do you expect him to leave everything he has invested over there to come home? This isn't about investments, woman. This is about my son's future. This is my home. This, this is my bloody home. This is not your home, my son. And they will never see it as yours. No matter how hard you work there, you're still just an immigrant to them. Daddy, mommy, immigrant own Harrods. Sorry, my dear has been declined. Are you okay? What's the matter? Are you alright? Is it just because of the fact that the card was declined or is there anything else? <laughs> I 
Christine, as a Christine, they the home office they refused my application again and oh. they they must have closed my bank account. Oh yeah. I have a friend, a friend lawyer. I'm going to give you her number and I will pay for all the charges. At least that will put a smile on your face. But why, 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 why would you do that? Come on, I've, I, I've been in your shoe before, but I fought for it. And it's not just me. We have lots of our, our, our people down here that are physically and emotionally battered because of this kind of the same issue. We don't have to cry about it. All you need to do is stand up, take a grip of yourself, take this card, take the card. You're going to be all right. Ah, in, in, a, in, a, in a Nigerian lawyer, uh, the, 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 la, the last lawyer that messed me up was Nigeria. I think, Christina, I don't want that card. Niger see, Nigerians are crooks. All Nigerians, they're all crooks. I'm very disappointed in you, and I'm very upset right now. Uh, I mean, I'm... Uh, I'm a Nigerian myself. Do I look like a crook to you? Well, Auntie, Auntie Christine is not like that, but... Does it mean because one Nigerian has messed you up, does it mean everybody is a crook? What's going on with you? Anyway, you don't have to use it. You don't have to call her. But I know that she's a very good woman. She is a Nigerian. But she's very good. Not all Nigerians are bad. I'm happy, I'm happy helping my own people, using my own people. I'm going to give you my card to make things easy for you. At least that will put a smile on your face. Here's my card. You can do your toiletries and other shopping that are not in my store, at least. Just, I will cap it and don't do anything that is not right with it. So you can have my card. At least you are smiling now. Thank you so much. It's all right. Thank you so much. Yes, it's okay. Dapo, what is it? So why are you here? No. Wait a second, okay? Dar, can I talk to you in your kitchen? Dapo, I don't know what this is all about. But you know, I don't have time for any bit of this because I'm having my immigration issues I'm sorting up right now. Which is why I'm here, to sort all that out. What are you talking about? Don't you remember what we discussed at the bar the other night? What? It's all right. You were drunk. I were not drinking your usual. Let, let me refresh your memory. So, um, you got all messed up crying about how the home office had screwed you over. <clears throat> I don't think I was crying, but continue. And I came up with a solution to your problems. Stop crying. Stop crying. <laughs> I have a solution to all your problems. Dabo, <laughs> Dabo. Ah, you tall, skinny, handsome young man. Listen, Dapo, can you just go straight to the point? Like, I don't have time for all this. Okay, okay, okay. So, uh, but seriously, seriously, <sighs> I have a solution to all your troubles. Hmm. Which is? We're gonna hack into the home office and sort out your documentation. I'm, I'm serious. <laughs> Got this friend who can do it. All you need, all I need really is your word and a down payment. And you can write on it. That will do it. You need like a thousand pounds. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah. That will listen. I'll call him right away. Ah. Oh. That will listen. All I have in my bank account right now is a thousand pounds. Just do it. But, but seriously, seriously, seriously. I'm just. I feel so bad about what my uncle did. And I just 
What to make it up to you? Really? That boy, I said do it! Do it! Okay. You usually charge like a 5,000, but it costs your party, you should do your discount. Oh my god, that boy, listen. So, I think you have to pay 2,000. One grand now and another when it's done. Dapo, this is my wallet. All my bank cards. If it requires my gym card, my NHS card, even my SD cards. The only thing is just do it. <coughs> but once we pay, there is no going back. Jesus Christ, God, Dapo, you don't understand. I said, just. Get it started. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna hack into the home office and sort out your throat. This is some mad shit, bro. Wait, 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 wait. We're actually hacking into the home office. Cheers to the home office. Hey, hey. Keep quiet. Cheers to the home hey. office. Stop. 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 We are Listen. This is the UK government home office. Stop. Cheers, cheers, cheers. So the home office! <laughs> Come on, you're such an idiot. You, you, you are such an idiot. But you... You, you, you... you want to get me arrested by the MI5? <sighs> well, you're completely fine with this. I was drunk. I was freaking drunk. Whatever I said during that state was not consent. Jesus Christ, man. Listen, Napo, please go take your hacker friend and get out of my house right now. But it's already been paid. The process has begun. We can't just stop now. Who are the we? Are we in this together? Dapo, there is no we. I, there will never be we, okay? Just get him and get out of this house. Right? Oh my God. Dapo, they might be listening to us. Who? Oh my God. The government. Who is listening they, to us? They might be. They might. Turn off your phone. Quick, turn off your phone. Okay. Uh, Jesus, I'm, I'm trying to stop this now. This guy's going to get me in trouble, my God. I've turned it off. off. I've turned it off. Jesus Christ. And your feet beats. Even my feet beats. Yeah, hey, but how do I count all the steps around the kitchen, huh? Everything. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit I have a tight schedule. So if you both don't mind, I'd like to have a meeting now, please. Oh. Sorry about that. It was just some brotherly banter. Uh, 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 we are not brothers, okay? Yeah, I, I, I know we're not blood brothers. I just meant that. Yes, yeah. what you meant was you grew up together, you came to this country together, you have known each other for over 20 years. You both even lost your virginity at the same party at the same night. What? How very cute, yes. <laughs> yes, I'm a hacker. Plus, you talked about it over Facebook last year. You see, hey, Derry, I know a lot about you. Funny guy, isn't he? <laughs> like what? Like who's handling your file at the home office? What sort of computer they're using? When they log in, when they log out, when they have lunch, when they take a shit, I know everything. You see, the first stage of hacking is reconnaissance, gathering data of your targets. Now I have to admit, hacking into a governmental organization is a different can, can you can you can you just stop talking about hacking, okay? I want to be able to tell the police I knew nothing about this when they call me for questioning. Well, I guess I'll be leaving. By the way, your deposit is non-refundable. No, and you won't be the first to have said that to me. Look, Abdul, wait. Look, I do not like my time to be wasted. And I don't want to spend the next 10 to 15 years in jail. Bro, what the hell are you all about? You're not the first person he's going to do this for. Do you want to get out of this situation or not? And what if he goes sideways? So what? See, you hypocrite. Your problem isn't that it is wrong. Your problem is you might get caught. Yeah. See, I've seen so many people like you in this terrible position. Too afraid to do anything about it. I am not afraid! Really? Because to me, it seems like it. See, your whole world is falling apart right in front of you. And you're doing nothing about it. All I ever try to do is help you. And you keep shutting me down. Every single time. Bro, I, I know I'm not as smart as you, but... I can't stand the way you keep treating me like an idiot. Oh, Dapo, please, I just... I don't have time for all this. This is why you have no friends. 
All you think about is yourself. All I want to know is who took my marker. Is it you that took my marker? No. Is it you? It's who took my marker? Please don't tell me. Who took my marker? It's you that took the marker. You suffer the punishment. But it, that, it was a mistake. Please don't tell her she beat me. I want to tell the truth. Idara, is there something you like to say? You know you're a good boy, you like to tell the truth. My mom said that not the people who pay for what they do. It was that poor that did it. Your friend, that poor? Yes. That poor, come here. That poor, come right here. Come right in front. Why are you wasting my time? Come here. 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 Come I've had a look at this, and your case is not the first. Your application was rejected on mere technicalities, and that was because it was filed a day out of time. A day? Could, could, they, not, could they not just have looked over a day? Um, not for West African immigrants, no. In the, yes, in the past, they waived it for European nationals and other nationals, but not for you. And... Um, I've seen people get deported because of this. But what are the chances of us winning this case? If I am to be honest with you, which I want to be, um, because I would not want you to waste my time, neither would I want to waste yours as well. Everything is still going to be based on technicalities. And if you have the money, yes, you can win it. Money. But I don't, I don't have, I don't have money right now. I do care about your case, you know, and I'm sure you know that. But you know that this consultation is costing Christine 300 pounds. I mean, I, I do understand. I understand, honestly. It's just that I've spent so much money on all of this already. As I mentioned earlier, a lot of people have been in your situation. Why don't you go home and have a think about it and then call me back? Okay, how, how long do I have to think about it? Well, Idari, you don't have the luxury of time. This should have been done weeks ago. Um, ideally, you should start this right now. Tomorrow, the latest. Where am I going to get 5,000 pounds? I mean, my parents are civil servants. Who, who, who's going to borrow me five thousand pounds? I can't really answer that question for you, Dari. I'm sure you know that. If you don't want my help, that's fine. I'm not going to force it on you. I mean, I I need I need your help. Like I'm really really desperate. There are lots of desperate people on the streets of London. What I can do for you right now is that we can. I can have you pay half of it. And when you win the case, the Home Office will pay the balance. That will mean they will be responsible for your cost. How about that? Okay. Thank you very much. I, I really appreciate it. I will need that initial payment, not later than tomorrow, please. I mean, but how do I... We are out of time now. Same time tomorrow. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. What, what, what do I do now? You never answer me. Sorry, I'm just, I'm just not getting any clear signals here. At least, give me a sign. Give me a sign, show me a sign that I will get a help from you if I do the right thing. And not just leave me here hanging. First Kings 19, 11 to 13. I beg your pardon? God is not in the noise. He's not in the storm, but he's in the calm, in the stillness. And there you will hear his voice. What's all I've gotten is just silence. Be patient, young man. Be sensitive, wait on him, and I'm sure you'll hear an answer. 
I don't have the luxury of time. Yeah, um, David, yeah, how are you? Um, actually, the reason I'm calling you uh, is, um, you know, I don't know if it's possible for uh, for you to lend me £2,000 or, I mean, better still, you know, you're owing me £1,000. Can I get that, you know, if possible? Oh, I need um, money let me call you back. Let me call you back. This guy's asking me to pay back his money. <laughs> Does he think he's going to get it? <laughs> Hello, David, you know I'm still on the phone, right? Shit. Hello, son. Good evening, Daddy. Why are you sounding so gloomy? Daddy, nothing. I'm fine. Are you? You know, you and I have uh, the same thing in common. I can tell when you are lying. No, it's just that the new lawyer I saw is demanding money from you by tomorrow. How much? I don't want to bother you with it, Dad. I mean, you already have a lot on your plate. Uh, have they even paid you out to at work yet? No, they, they haven't paid us yet. But you are priority. And instead of you to go and ask them to pay you, you sit down here every day reading your Bible from Genesis to Revelation. How will they pay you when they know you will not start any trouble? Woman, please, can I have some silence? Let me speak to my son. If you know what to do, why don't you go to them and tell them so that they will pay us? My terrorist, Boko Haram. My son, sorry for the interruption. Eh? Your mother here is the one disturbing. Um, okay, let me see if I can go to the bank tomorrow and if see they can convert uh, some money and I can send you one thousand pounds. If that is okay. Well, I would, I would really appreciate that, Daddy. I carried him for nine months, remember? But you want to deny me the pleasure of speaking to him. <coughs> Who denies you pleasure of speaking in this house? Are you not always speaking? Oh, well, it's your mother. She wants to talk with you. Hello, Idari. <laughs> I hope you've been watching the night miracle videos I've been sending you every night. It starts at 9 p.m. every night and Fridays, 1 p.m. Are you hearing me? Mommy, I've heard. Okay. See, what you need now is to engage in spiritual warfare. Serious one. Because what you're going through is spiritual. So you need to engage in the spiritual too so that you'll be able to fight. Uh, a friend of mine is coming to London and I have given her a bottle of anointing oil for you. It will get to you as soon as she arrives. Mommy, please, I'm really stressed out right now. Please, can I please sleep? Okay. If you want to go, go. I am trying to advise you. But it's very obvious you don't want to listen to me. If you want to go, go. But remember, I am your mother. I carried you for nine months in this my room. And you sucked these two breasts for four solid years. At least your sister had the decency of sucking for one year and six months. But you, everyday breast. Everyday breast. You will tie your shoelaces and come under my breast to suck as though you were drinking from the running tap. My son, um, it's okay. Uh, uh, let's. I'll see what I can do and get to uh, give you that money tomorrow. Is that okay by you? Thank you, Daddy. Daddy Messere, good night. You are short of a thousand and two hundred pounds, Idari. Uh, 
This is not acceptable. But that's all I was able to put together within a very short time. I understand, but I can't, I can't do this. I have staff to pay. But I'm, I'm, I'm very desperate. Just, just, just help me. Please, there are desperate people all over the streets of London. We all have our own issues to deal with. I'm sorry, I can't do this. Until you get the, the, the full deposit, I can't be of any assistance. Okay, so you, you, you can't... No, 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 I can't. First they say you never make it, put a record, then you break it You keep on waiting, praying, finding up a way to take it Put it to another level while your patience waiting out The patience gone, so you go ahead like Atlanta South I promise you all my pen be right until it's bleeding out Then you're gonna be pointing out when they see you speeding south You call me Ludo Tunji cause you know I feel the drought I knew you'd be back Her desperation really has done a number on you, hasn't it? Are you going to help me with it or not? So you want to go ahead with it? Well, why else will I be here? Nah. I don't want your money. Just take it, man. The money we were given previously was the deposit, and I don't think I would have enough cash for later. As I said, I don't want your money. Let's just say you'll owe me one later. <coughs> but why do I not like the sound of this? You will like the sweet sound of being legal and a permanent resident of this country. So what next? Go home. I'll call you. When? Just go home. I'll call you when I'm ready. When people can't be fabulous I'm the rap potter like Harry Famulus But we never let anything is possible Short sketch, G-strings, bra, visible No fear when I'm spitting with a low game I'm trying to make it simple for you to get a real chair mm. Guy, waiting for like that one I just they look you laugh as you deform Batman You think say now you get the whole area You go by rain, heard I'm sick like malaria Waiting, waiting, waiting for like that one Waiting, waiting, waiting for like that one Waiting, waiting, waiting for that cat one. I just did look you laugh fast, you deform part one. Waiting, waiting, waiting for that cat one. Waiting, waiting, waiting for that cat one. Waiting, waiting, waiting for that cat one. Shabi, you don't forget that. Hello? Abdul! Abdul! Hello there, I'm calling regarding the accident you recently had. Is your father, your, your generation that we have accidents in Jesus' name?
you guys seen up there? What's, what's going on here? You might as well shut the door and take a seat instead of just standing there. You don't tell me what to do in my own house. Ederi, I'm simply advising you in your best interest. Come, take a seat. So I guess I should um, serve you drinks as well, yeah? Because vitality goes a long way. I have a super mop. Wow. Sounds like, you know, you guys don't really understand sarcasm. And by the way, does that say mom, the tattoo? You must really love your mom a lot. Yeah. I killed her. Can we get straight into this? We better, John. This is Gucci. This is Louis V. <laughs> and those actually names on your death certificate. Are you mad, man? I'll warn you not to refer to me in the third person when I'm sitting right there. Make that two bottles of sweet tomatoes and some hot Nigerian food with a lot of pepper. Hey, they love the pepper. Come on, make it snappy. Hurry up. Make it snappy. I'm coming. Can we please pick this up, yeah? Thank you. residents in the UK. What? Well, our friend Gucci here works at the home office. <laughs> works as what? Pick it up and look at it. Go on. Oh, it's real. It's very real. And it's yours. No, I'm not taking this. You can't walk into my house with two strangers carrying guns and you expect me no way. Please. What? It's a stick up. Are you what? Yeah, she's crazy. Are you actually not? Are you actually crazy? Boys, calm down. Calm down. Hey, Dory, I want you to pick up that phone and tell them it was a mistake. Now! You called emergency services. Which service do you require? No. Yes, sir. You called emergency services. Which yeah, service do you um, require? I'm absolutely fine. That was a mistake. That was a mistake. I'm so sorry. All right, sir. Are you okay? Oh, yes, I'm absolutely sure. Um, Are you sure? Uh, yeah, yeah. All right, then. Have a lovely day. If you do require services, sir, please do not hesitate to call us back. Yeah, all right. Thank you. Bye. Oh, Clara. <laughs> wow. You actually called the police on us. I think we're joking, don't we? <clears throat> So, well, well, 
we have generously delivered what you were most desperate for, your permanent residency. Congratulations. You're welcome. As I've mentioned before, I'm not in it for the money, at least not from you. Well, I have a feeling that you didn't just come to deliver this. <laughs> I'm dealing with a genius here. <laughs> right, no, I'm not. You have a bank account, and we have some Nigerian business partners for, who from time to time will send some money. Well, Abdul, I'd rather pay the rest of the money I owe you than get myself involved in all of these. You make it sound like as if you had more than one option. We need you and you will assist us for the next six months. That's how this works. <sighs> Abdul, is that how you guys go around taking advantage of vulnerable people in desperate need of their statuses? I'll stop talking about you. <clears throat> so, I text you every time there's money being transferred into your account. Then you either withdraw or you send it to your accounts. I tell you to, okay? By the way, the money in your account now is a little something for your troubles. Go ahead, check. Whoa! 5,000 pounds? You are behind on your rent, aren't you? Uh, yeah. Well, there we go. I think we must leave. We have another appointment. Boys? It was a pleasure doing business. Well, I wish I could say the same. Anything fun, I'm gonna put a cap in your head. I'll play in it. What the? Daryl, what do you want after how you spoke to me last time? Uh, well, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I, I see you're expecting a baby. Well, congratulations. Um, I... Where, where did you say Dapa was again? Dubai. Dubai? I didn't know he was able to afford a plane ticket. Well, there's a lot of things you don't know about Kim. Really? Yes, really. He's going to get me a lovely big diamond ring and he's going to propose to me and we're going to a destination wedding. Oh, wow, destination wedding? Yes. <coughs> destination. Well, um, that's, that, that, that's, that's a, good, a good news. Um... Well, what do you want anyways after how you treated him last time? Oh, he told you about that? Yes, he told me everything, as you can see. <laughs> Well, um, I mean, I've been trying to um, contact that one. He's not been picking up my calls. Uh... Well, you need to leave. Right, okay, yeah. that's fine. I would, um, I'll take my leave. And once again, congratulations, okay? Uh, woo. Woo. One, two, two boxes of PS5. Seems like that was been making some money here lately. Well, it's not if you've been, it's just leave. Okay, that's fine. I'll um, take my leave. Thank you. Um, um, congratulations. Yeah. So, how can I help you? Um, obviously, you're a lawyer, maybe. I, I just need to ask you a few questions. Ah, so you're finally in need of my expertise. Well, something like that. Go ahead. So, let's imagine, yeah, somebody puts a very huge amount of money in your account, right? Like, somebody launders money, like a money launderer, to send to someone else. Does that make you part of the crime? Idari, are you now into money laundering? <laughs> Madame Foucault, ah. Okay. 
Google who parties to an offense. Parties to what? Who parties to an offense. It says everyone is a party to an offense who actually commits it, does or omits to do anything for the purpose of aiding any person to commit it or abet any person in committing it. So theoretically, the individual is still a party to the offense, but if you report it, then you have taken steps to stop it. So in essence, you're a key witness and you do end up behind bars. See, no one likes a snitch. But a snitch is also the smartest person amongst criminals. It doesn't get any jail time. Are you sure everything is okay, Dari? Everything is okay, Dari. Okay, um... Can I ask you another question, eh? What if... Um... They use a gun to force you... Into... Um... You know... Transferring or laundering the, 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 the money, does that also implicate you by any chance? No, their life was in danger and they were under duress. You'd tell me something was wrong, wouldn't you, Dari? Of course I would not. Hold on, I'll, I'll, I'll call you back. There's somebody yeah. I'll, I'll call you back. All right, take care of yourself and please don't do something that you're going to regret. Yeah. Be good. Hmm? Bye. Benny, eh? You have not paid your rent. And you've been avoiding me. Eh? What nonsense is that? I know, I know. You know. What do you know? You've not paid. That's why we are saying. Bo go me daddy, bring my money. At least I'm at least I'm, I'm working on it. You are working on it. If I remove you out now and bring someone who has worked on it already, people will say I'm unfair. Eh? What kind of nonsense is that? Please, Bo go me daddy, bring my money. I need my money. Sir, landlord, please, I really don't have time for this right now. Like, don't. Oh, see when they are going here with me. You don't have time for what? Oh, Jack Basin, you are telling me you don't have time for it. No, oh, daddy, I need my money. You've been avoiding me. You've been messing me up. I'm paying mortgage on this thing. You will not say it's for the lady. Make my ticket shake one shake me for it. Sora, Abby, look at the way he's looking at me like Dundee United. How much is you owing you? Look, this is none of your business, young man. People, we have serious problem here. You, this, this, is, this is not where you put your dirty mouth. Eh? So, I'm getting this debt is settled for the next two months. You are carrying this amount of cash all over the place. <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> you see, these are credible people you should be moving with. Eh? Only basically, you better run away. If not, you yourself, you'll be broke. Anyway, God bless you. If we have several grandchildren, I think you know. Ah! Why do you know? you. So, um, I used to rent. I thought they gave you money. I beg your pardon? I meant that the, um... Dapo, these guys came to my house. They dropped money in here. How, how did you know? Like, something isn't adding up, Dapo. Does that matter? Of course it does matter. <sighs> I just paid your debt not more than a minute after stepping into your place and you're already shouting at me. Dapo, you went to Dubai and then you got diamonds. And then two 
PS5 game consoles. That for how greedy can you be? People are even looking for one. You bought two. That for how much are they paying you to do this? How to dare me? you accuse me, Dari? Piece of who's, who do you suddenly sort of think you are? Have you done, Chris? That for they had guns pointed to my head. Guns. That for you, you, you've ruined my life. Look. Look, I didn't know the card. Well, they did carry guns. But they had a solution to your problem. And a solution to your greed! Oh, shut up, Idari. You have no idea what I've been through, so it's easy for you to call me greedy. My father needed that money for his kidney. Go to hell. Well, I'm pretty much in hell. And guess who put me there? You. All they want for you is to move money for six months. Stop making it harder than it sounds. Dapo, first it was hacking. And now you're connecting me to three other different types of crimes, Dapo. Look, you know what? Can you just stop being a wuss for once and try to do the dirty job? You never want to do the dirty job. You want someone else to do it for you. Dapo, you are mad. You are stuck raving mad. Six months. That's all they want. You won't be the first and you won't be the last. Dapo, I don't want a number. I just want to get out of this. Look, I'm leaving. Dapo. We can still get out of this. Who told you I wanted to get out of this? An opportunity I prayed for. I don't understand. <laughs> well, you wouldn't because you've always lived a comfortable life. Looking at everyone else like you're shit. Now, what are you talking about? You remember when we were kids and um, you had to tell that teacher that there was the one who broke our jokes? I do remember and that we were only kids at the time. Yeah, yeah, we were. I thought I told you to do this eh? I went home that day with so many mouths on my back. What's wrong? My mother couldn't stop crying. She was already, already dealing with postnatal depression at that time, and then she had to do it with my pain too. What did this to you? What happened? What did you do? What kind of thing is this? What kind of thing is this? How can somebody do this to a child? Hey, my only child. What kind of thing is this? There's more. <laughs> Remember in 2001 when uh, word went out that some highly placed lecturers had forged your certificates? Yes, I do remember. Then you must remember that my dad was one of them. Of course. How could you forget? You must have been the topic at your morning devotions. Ayo, I can't do this thing that you are asking me to do. If you don't defend me, I will lose this job. Everyone in this office respects you. Eswa, I need you on my team. You know that I am a Christian. I will not stand or defend something when I know it is a lie. You forged your certificate, Ayo. I will not support that. I do not have any other job. How do I fit my family if I lose this job? No other university will hire me when the local newspapers are already carrying my story. I need your help. Please, help me. You don't need me, Ayo. You need God. You need God. In that case, you will live to regret. I promise you, you will live to regret this.
No lecturer. No lecturer stood up for my father. He was humiliated. He was kicked out of his job. He became a drunk. And he had kidney problems from that. Well, but that, well, you cannot... You, 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 you cannot blame me for all of this. <laughs> it wasn't enough for your dad to mess up with our family. Your mom had to play a part too. sitting down here. If you don't mind, please can you move back? Janet, Janet, let it not be you this morning. Am I the only person sitting in front? Eh? Am I the only person sitting in front? What kind of embarrassment is this now? You want me to stand up in front of everybody and start going to the back? As if I've not been embarrassed enough. Just, please respect yourself. It's, Margaret, it's just a harmless advice. Chief advisor, I am not moving. Please. Margaret, you're the one embarrassing yourself the same way your husband embarrassed your whole family. Oh. Janet here is not embarrassing you. She's only trying to help you. Okay. Ma, <laughs> I beg, Madam Margaret, can you just pack yourself to the back where you're meant to sit, please? It's not people like you that is supposed to be sitting in front here. Please, please. please. Madam, please relocate yourself before we relocate you. I am not going to. Anyway, please, ah. please. I'll help you with your bag. Please, what, just what, move. What is happening here? Ma. In the church? Ma, she doesn't want to move. She's not supposed to be in front. We've asked her to move and she's not moving. Please, can you cooperate with them? Mommy let, mommy, let it not be you. Mommy, let it not be you. Please, madam, this seat is for the guests. Why don't you people tell me things? You want okay. for me to sit down? No, what kind of embarrassment is it? I know that you have slammed me in this church. Please. I am not going to anywhere. Let them sit somewhere please. else. Okay, Ashan, please, okay, take your Please, let madam. me go. I think I'm not going to anywhere. Madam, I'm not going to anywhere. Oh, my God. Inside church. Inside I told you to do it like this. He died. When, when I said that you had no friends, I meant it. You've never been a friend to me. Just a self-centered bastard from a self-righteous home. But then, the end justifies the means. And you, Idari, have just been a means to me. I mean, I made 50,000 pounds from all this, your laundry, business things and then a further 500,000, 500 pounds here from the one I got from my uncle for screwing you over. That what you mean you planned all of this? Huh, I don't feel so special. I made 200,000 pounds from the last two people and you've not made you up my well yet. Dapo, Dapo, we can still get out of this and I'm willing to forgive you. Forgive me. I don't need your forgiveness or saving. It means nothing to me. You you mean nothing to me. Now get up and do as you have been told. Get up. The guys are coming back from Nigeria and they are going to they're going to need you to be useful again. Keep on the You know how so I'm an office. 
You know get the work, you know get the skills, you know get the money, but you want to do Make you hustle every day. I'm on your baby good Just put to work and believe in God and Eloy. So much more you could do well. It's just a matter of time you could pop up. And all the people when you're like you go the love up. You go the collect all the money, you go level up. Hello, Daddy. My son, you don't talk to me anymore. What is wrong? Well, Daddy, I'm really so sorry. I've just been um, you know, preoccupied and very stressed. You know, so I'm sorry, Daddy. Hope all is well. What happened between yourself and Dapo's dad? Why are you asking me about him? I mean, Daddy, recently, Dapo told me that you, you, you know, you ruined his dad's life by by making him lose his job and 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 hence why he turned into drinking ayo actually told me so tell a lie for him and i simply refused daddy that boy has hated our family because of these all these years well that's because his father couldn't own up to his mistakes but he said he chose to put the blame on other people. I mean, Daddy, you are you are actually right. Don't let him do that to you. Hmm. <sighs> Ijari, I've listened to you very carefully. And I understand where you're coming from. What you're experiencing is not real. It's common. But what, what, what am I going to do now? Like, they put me in the middle of all this. What am I supposed to do? Listen, he has people. He has people. He has people. That is just to scare you. It's your bank card. They've been putting illegal funds. I know. You told me already. So what do we do now? What do we do? The good thing is that you have come to me, you have explained every single thing to me, so I will take the right action. This is my niece. Mm. I don't use them for anything, so I can use it to beg you, eh? I don't my want dear, to go to jail. Don't worry, you are not going to go to jail. I don't want to make my you parents feel less proud of Don't me. worry yourself. I, I you know, know exactly what you are going through and how you feel. You know what? Sit down, sit down. Don't go to them again. Do not pick up their phone calls anymore. Don't go to them again. The you don't need them. No nearing them again. You don't need any of these people at all. But the good thing that you have done is that you have told the truth. And that is why I'm saying I will do the right thing. Okay? okay? You're, you're, you're definitely sure. I'm sure. I'm sure. Don't worry yourself. It's all right. Thank you, Auntie Christine. Put yourself together. I'll Thank see you again. Thank you, Auntie Christine. All right, my dear. Take care now. Thank you. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay, love. That's all right. Take care. It's all right, my dear. I'm going to have to call the uh, police and report this because I just can't keep quiet. Hello? Where's the money? What money? Listen, tell your boss I ain't doing this no more. What? <laughs> I never knew you had hearing difficulties. I'm gonna kill you. I dare you. I'm hot like ice. Bro. Guy. Wait, 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 wait. Guy. Wait, 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 wait. Guy. Wait, 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 wait. Guy. Wait, 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 wait. We connect the kitchen food with dreadlocks. Charlie King Kapo, what connects the face with the head boss? What we ever connect Ibo? No, 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 no. Am I trying out for a high jump? Huh? Somebody wants to die young. Waiting connect every G with a jam form. Waiting connect high high with we'll winning Mr. Handsome. This ain't money, man. man. Trust me, man. Make sure that money is complete, boys. Okay, boss. Definitely. So did you think we did not know you were coming after your little theatrics at Abdul's place? What's this little display supposed to be? Let's light him up, boss. Go on, then light me. Light me if you got the balls. Light me! I will. Go on, 
guys, what? You think guys, I'm... stop this. What are you, what are you, what are you, what are you stop, stop this. Stop this. I'm done, yeah? There's, there's nothing inside. Yeah. Yeah. This is, you think Abdul did not tell me? Guys, Abdul, 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 Yeah, shoot me. Go on, shoot me then. Go shoot. Go on, shoot. 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 shoot then. Go on, go on. Stop. Stop it. Get off him. The ambulance, please. You wait. You weren't supposed to fight them. You weren't supposed to try and be very good. Help us! Hey! Hey! Idari, hey! Wake up! Idari! Action man. Zoro. So you thought it was wise to be fighting men with knives and guns, Idari? What did you know about that? How will I not know about it? It was all over the news. Everybody knew about it. Even your poor mother knew about it. When she heard, she was flinging herself up and down like she was going through some kind of exorcism or something. Is that fair, Dari? Mm -hmm. Well, I hear that poor and his stupid henchmen are in prison now. But <laughs> tell me something, Dari. Was all of this really worth it? Getting stabbed, getting tortured by Dapo and his men. All for what? Surely it would have been easier for you to just come back home to Nigeria. Mm -hmm. I mean, look at Nigeria. With bad governance, bad healthcare, bad uh, uh, education, you know. Okay, I, I hear you. But this same Nigeria has rich men and billionaires that are living very okay inside it. In their backyards, huh? I mean, God forbid this rich man gets into accidents. They'll be able to get himself in private jets, fly to any country they want to, that he's been given to our nationality. I mean, you remember the day mommy got slapped by a policeman in front of us, in front of me, in front of you and daddy? I remember. We couldn't do anything. Don't even remind me. If the police officer had fired his firearm, Mommy would have been dead by now, and nothing still would have happened. I, I really understand what you're saying, bro. I really do. Honestly, I don't want to die in university like my mates, who were kidnapped. And as if that wasn't enough, they were then killed because there was no ransom money for them. It's not fair. We deserve a better life than that. Hmm. You will get it. But that reminds me. He was given this to give to you. Yeah. Take it easy, please. Okay. Should I open it for you? Oh, yeah. oh you're fine. So, have they given you permanent residency? I think they are giving me the opportunity to reapply. Is that a good thing? Well, it's not really a bad thing, but it just means I have more time to fight for what I want. Rambo! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I think mommy is calling. Hello, mommy. Where is my son? I need to speak to my son, Fon. One oh, second, let me just... <laughs> Is that you? Mommy, calm down now. <laughs> My heart was really broken. <laughs> 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 no, my heart was broken. Please be calm down, it's okay. <laughs> Every song that rises up against you in judgment. I'm here, come for. We would always be immigrants, and wherever we find ourselves, we are strong, we are bold, we remain fighters. Keep fighting. Who am I without y'all? How can I fly before I walk a crawl? You're the reason I stand and not fall. Keep pushing the short boy to the day I stand tall. I can't tweet him, but they never want to follow me. They might think that I keep feeling like a wannabe. 
took petrol and poured at me Right now I speed, they can feel the real fire that is burning me They keep bragging, they go murder me So I had a fiend them, told them legendaries wanna murder me Claim me to be friends, but they turn to me Now they see my paper chasing, they all coming like they're friend of me Keep praying to your tenity, they might gon' be scared of me Two-Face and Nero gon' be family I took my enemies, come on, it's one MSCs Money no be problem, take away your messages Thank you for many things For my friends and my enemies